What's up people of the internet? I'm the big bolt here with yet another video. In this video we will be testing the Intel Celeron N2840 which is a CPU based on the Silvermont architecture and part of the Patreon family of power efficient processors. It has 2 cores and 2 threads and it has a frequency of up to 2.58 GHz. The Celeron N2840 has the Intel HD graphics page rail as the integrated graphics, which have 4 unified shaders and a frequency of up to 700 in h 2 MHz in the N2840's case. It's also based on the Intel HD 4000's architecture, by using the latest driver suite available. We also have 4GB of RAM in single channel mode, as well as a 500GB hard drive for the operating system and also in which the game is installed. As per operating system we are using Windows X Lite Optimum 10 Pro version 2, you can find the full description of the specs in the video description down below. After benchmarking the worst optimized game in existence on my gaming laptop, let's go back to low end friendly stuff. The game that we'll be benchmarking today is 1v1.lol, which is literally Fortnite for low end PCs. We're gonna be running the memory duct up before watching the game, and I've set it to clean the RAM once usage reaches 90%. And let's get straight to the points now! Now, 1v1.lol doesn't have a resolution option and instead runs at your desktop resolution, so in order to get the game to run at a lower resolution than your monitor's native one, all you have to do is press your start button, then tab out of the game, right click on your desktop, go to display settings and from there you can lower the desktop resolution. Let's lower it to 800 by 600 which will also make the game run at that resolution and you are set up.
if you're that desperate, you can lower the resolution to 640 by 480 by returning to the display settings, then going to advanced display settings, display adapter properties, list all modes, choose the 640 by 480 option if you have it, then click on OK and finally apply and there you go my potato gamers.